Welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing a little bit of an experiment. We're in the Mercedes EQS and we've purposely not been charging it to see if we can get it the range down pretty low and then go to the Electrify America 350 kilowatt chargers and see how quickly it actually charges when it's really low on capacity. You take a look at the range right there. We're at 47 miles of range left. And if you take a look at the view right here, we're at 11% charge. We've got uh, maybe what, seven, eight miles, nine miles to go to get to our next destination. Um, then we're gonna stop, run a couple errands, then drive uh, another few miles, and that's where the chargers are past that point. We'll see what the capacity remaining is at that point. It should be below 10% then uh, I'll show you guys what sort of uh, charging rate this thing gets when we plug it in. I got it parked over here. Kids are getting a haircut right now. I've got the uh, climate control running to maybe run the battery down some more because the uh, charging station is only a mile and a half up the road. So I'm trying to get that battery as low as possible since we don't have long to go. Um, that way we can see what the maximum effect is of these high power Electrify America 350 kilowatt chargers. All right, we're pulling into the station where the chargers are. We've got 40 miles of range remaining. And if we look at the battery percentage, we're right at 10%. There's the Electrify America charger. We're gonna pull in. My wife found a new trick. You uh, use a camera to know where you are. in had to switch spots that charger wasn't working got this plugged in connecting processing payment authorized and that's all I had to do I didn't have to come up uh, on the app and do anything and um, interestingly enough that this is the second time I'm using one of these it automatically detects the car and from the profile on the car itself it automatically goes to your profile and it tells you this is the Mercedes Me charging plan. And if you read closely, it includes two years of complimentary charging, no charging session time cap on complimentary charging through October 31st, 2023. That means you get completely free charging with no time limit until October of 2023. And after that point, as long as you haven't hit your two year mark, you get 30 minutes of high-speed charging, which if all the documentation is correct, 30 minutes is enough to get you from 10% uh, to 80%, I think, but we'll see. So right now it is 5.12 p.m. We just plugged in and it says we've got 29 minutes left until it's at 80%. That's pretty crazy. Maybe, maybe not, that seems ridiculous. But uh, we'll see. And you see the uh, charge rate creeping up really quickly. It is at 200 kilowatts. You see it right there. And it says, uh, oh, I see, 201. Charge speed required, requested by your vehicle. So the vehicle is requesting 202 kilowatts. This is delivering 196 kilowatts. And I think these EQSs are a 200 kilowatt max on the charging system. So that, that sounds correct. Now it's requesting 203 kilowatts. Wow, that's nuts. Yep, sitting right at 203 kilowatts. This is it. 197, 198, 190, yeah, it's bouncing between 196 and 198. Nope, just hit 199 kilowatts. And so far, just in, in what, two minutes, it's delivered 
four and a half kilowatt hours, almost five now. So we'll we'll give it some time and come back. Now this is sitting at 204 kilowatts requested by the vehicle. So it's taking a little bit more than the 200. And this is crazy, crazy fast. Wow. And if you were to have to pay for it, and you didn't have the free two years of Mercedes me charging, you'd be at 37 cents per kilowatt hour pre-tax. Or what is that, 37 cents per minute. Oh, that's interesting. I guess it's the kilowatt hour price minus zero or for whatever your session is, plus 37 cents a minute. I guess they charge you per minute for being there. We are now at 206 kilowatt requested by the car. And this is bouncing between 200 and 202. So slightly higher than 200 kilowatt. I wonder if that's software limited by Mercedes and not necessarily hardware limited. So it's leveling out. It was bouncing between 200 and 201 kilowatts being delivered. Looks like it's leveling out at 201. And this is 206, 207 is what it's bouncing around at. It is 515, we're three minutes into our charge. And it says we only have 25 minutes left to be at 80%. We went from 10%, actually 9% when I parked, to 19% in four minutes. That is just nuts. And it looks like this is leveled out at 207 kilowatts being requested by the vehicle. And this is starting to level out right around 202 kilowatts being delivered. We'll give it some time and come back. Aiden, let's go take a walk, buddy. So we're here walking around the outlet mall and uh, I'm checking the app here to see how it's charging. We are 10 minutes in, it's 522. And we're at 36% charge. So in 10 minutes, we went from 9% to 36 minutes. And if you can see here at the bottom, the charge rate has dropped to 182 kilowatts. So the charge rate's no longer at 202, it's down to 182 as the battery is going up. Looks like it's at 179 now. So 522, that's 10 minutes in, we're at 38% when we started at nine. So almost 20 additional percent I'm sorry, 30% of battery charge in 10 minutes. All right, we're walking back over the car. Kids are getting a little bit bored, but we are at 5.35 p.m. We started this at 5.12, so it has been, what is that, 23 minutes. And we are, let's see here, we are at 65%. So we went from 9% to 65% in 23 minutes. And our charge rate is down to 131 kilowatts right now. So even at 65%, it's still charging at a really fast pace. I'm surprised. I thought the charge rate would be a lot lower at this point. But still at 131 kilowatts. That's crazy fast charging. And um, yeah, we're creeping up to so 65% right now. Let's see what it ends up being by the time we walk over there and get to the car. All right, we're back at the vehicle. I'm gonna go ahead and unplug it now. We're at 5.38 p.m. Started at 5.12, so that's 16 minutes into it. Or what is that? I'm sorry, 26, so 25 minutes, it says we've been charging. And we've got five minutes left to get to 80%. So that means if we get to that 30 minute marker, we will have gotten from 9% to 80% in 30 minutes. That's pretty amazing. And it's still charging at 126 kilowatts, 127, even at 71% full on the battery. So it's at 71% full, still charging at 126 kilowatts. And in three, in four minutes, you'll be at 80% charge. And that's where I have it capped. I'm gonna go ahead and unplug it at this point. To unplug it on these vehicles, you hit the charge button right here. You wait until it releases and gives you the white light unplug your charger 
There we go. We'll put this guy back on. And look at this. Zero dollars. Thank you, Mercedes. I love your plan. That is awesome. Hope you enjoyed this video, found it helpful. If you were curious what the high-speed charging looks like on these EQSs, what the truly, truly high-speed charging looks like when they're so empty, this is what it looks like. I love you guys. I will see you next time.